And what? Already married. According to who? According to whom? The state of New York. That's impossible. Then who is Patrick Thomas Sullivan of Astoria, New York? Yes, who is he? I don't know. He's your husband. I thought I had run over an animal or a garbage bag. You didn't want to stop and check. Oh, no, I didn't. It was a dark colored car and it had nosed into the left lane and just stopped for no reason. For no reason? Yes. And then I had to go around it. This entire ceremony is invalid. I'm sorry, sir. I cannot allow you to light a fire anywhere within the hotel premises. We filed a missing persons report and sent a registered letter to the family. Mother never got it. She probably threw it away with her unpaid bills. So you just sat on your lazy ass and said, my job's done. We do the best we can. Now she's dead. He was wide awake and summering on Block Island with the rest of the Underhills when I spoke with him just now. No kidding. Mr. Underhill also mentioned that with deep regret, he doesn't have a grandson. <laughs> Security! I was just whittling my Raggedy Ann for my Raggedy Andy, so they might Raggedy Raggedy. Where's her final check being sent? She didn't give me a forwarding address. If I find out there's something you're not telling me. I told you and the police everything I know. Squeeze them like you're crossing the Mexican border, and Montezuma's revenge is about to explode out your ass. Tight. I want to bounce a dime off that ass. Do you think I got to Helsinki by laughing my way? No. I would appreciate it if you would leave me to wrestle my demons. And leave me alone into the deep, dark night. I think he sees hockey as a way out for him. You know, with colleges. Somebody gets between him and that. Who knows? Is he that good? <laughs> you know how jocks get. Like they own the world and nobody better get in their way. I was in the chess club. <laughs>